So I've been doing a lot of drawings in the sketchbook. I'm almost done. I've only got nine pages left at this point. And when I get the sketchbook done, I'll be doing a flip through of all the pages of all the drawings that I've done inside of the, this whole sketchbook, but things are going pretty well. I've been doing a lot of drawing as always. I have now at this point several sketchbooks that are almost complete and yeah things are going pretty good and I've got a couple more moleskin sketchbooks that I want to get filled up and get all the doodles put in them and show everybody what I've been creating. When I got up this morning I try to be a bit more relaxed than what I have been. It helps me in drawing and it allows me to be more creative and not get so much anxiety and being worried about trying to make everything perfect and just having fun with it. I've been doing so many drawings now at this point that I've gotten confused of what file is which on my computer because there are so many on there. The other day I did a little bit of computer coding kind of and I figured out a way to make multiple folders at one time so that I'm able to just drag and drop files and video files into the folders rather than trying to sift through thousands of different video files and time lapses of drawings. So I have that going for me. It's very time consuming and does take quite a while, but I'll get to it eventually and I'll eventually get it completed. And when I do, I will show everybody all of my doodles, but it's going to be quite a while until I get through all of them. I have thousands of videos that that I've recorded to upload. And I had them all stored on one of my drives and I even have each of the drives on my computer organized by edited, unedited, and then back up and so forth. But yeah, it's a lot of video files. I've got a lot of work ahead of me, but sometimes when I just don't feel like video editing, I'll just do a bunch of drawing and then when I've done so many drawings throughout the day that I want a short break, I'll get up, walk around, go for a walk, I'll make myself some tea and then I'll do some video editing to kind of, you know, just make things a little bit different because when you do the same thing over and over all the time, you start to lose creativity you don't really have as many ideas of what to create. And so, I think it's good to take a break about every hour when you're drawing so that you can stretch and move around. And it keeps you from getting all cramped up in your muscles and helps you feel better because when you just don't feel good physically, it does make it pretty hard to draw because you just don't really have the motivation because your back might be hurting or your neck. So moving around does help quite a bit. You don't want to be in the same location for too long of a time. But yeah, things are going pretty good at this point. And I want to see if I can complete the other two moleskin sketchbooks I have by the end of the year. Well, not this year, but by the end of 2020. I'm pretty sure I can do it. Although that's going to be, I think, 220 drawings in the sketchbook. These pages are larger than the ones that are in my Pentalic sketchbook, about four times as large, so it's going to be quite a challenge to complete it, but I think I can do it. I just gotta put my mind on it and just keep at it and eventually I'll get it complete. 
But yeah, things are going pretty good and just doing a lot of doodling. But anyways, I've got some things to catch up on and things to work on for the rest of the day. So thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Have fun drawing and have a good day. Talk to you later.